Welcome to the Robert C. Williams Museum of Paper Making Paper Play Activities. My name is Anna and I'm the education creator for the museum. And today I'll be showing you how you can make a paper octagon that moves and changes into a paper spiral. So it is a kinetic origami. You can make it with origami paper or computer paper. It moves a little bit more smoothly with origami paper, but either will do. So to get started today, I'm going to need eight pieces of origami paper that are cut to three by three squares. So I'm going to start with this one here. You're going to start your fold by folding in half. half again, the other direction, and then I'm going to flip my paper over and I am going to fold diagonally and diagonally the other direction. And then I'm going to very simply fold my corner into the folds that are already there. And then I'm going to fold it in half. So I'm taking this whole thing and folding it in half along the fold line that's already there. And then I'm going to take this little bottom part, there's a diagonal here on this side, and a diagonal on the other side. And I'm just going to press in and reverse that fold inside. So this is the shape I will want to create for all eight of my sheets of paper. So to show you that fold again, So now that I have all eight pieces made, I'm ready to start putting them together. So I'm going to take this piece with the solid edge here and the open tail ends, and I'm going to turn my uh, next piece vertical with the open ends there as well. And I am going to put my yellow piece of paper around my pink one and fold in these little edges. And I'm going to repeat the same thing again. Solid edge going into my pink piece, folding my little edges, and pressing it down. Taking my orange piece, folding it in. And I will repeat for all of the pieces. And now I'm down to my very last piece, which is going to follow the same rules as the others. I just want to be careful when I put my orange piece around my yellow piece and I tuck in those little edges here. I want to make sure to tuck the orange into the yellow but not inside, not um, over really my little pink edges there. 
And if you have another one that pops out in the process, just put it back together. Thank you for joining us today for Paper Play.